Hi everyone and welcome to another Sense AG video. Today I want to talk to you about the Spitfire cockpit. There's something that's been driving me quietly insane for quite some time, uh, and I presume others as well, uh, and it's the baked on uh, reflection textures as well as the scratches within the cockpit. They've been there for quite some time. I know a lot of the community are not happy with it. There you go. They're just not very nice. Um, so I wanted to find a way to get rid of it. So I did. And what I'll do is I'll show you exactly how well that worked. Now there are two options here. Uh, I can remove the um, reflections in their entirety. So that means they can be taken from the dials and the cockpit glass. Uh, as well as the scratches being removed as well, because when you look at a certain angle uh, in certain sunlights, it looks like somebody's been at it with a Brillo pad. So it gets rid of those as well. Now, you can let me know in the comments below what your preference is, whether it's uh, uh, preferable to have the, the cockpit clean and the dials to have the reflections, or just to have the whole lot without the reflections in their entirety. Anyway, let me show you what the cockpit looks like with the changes in place. And here we are back in the sim with the modification activated. We're in the standard spit. Let me zoom in for you and I'll show you that the baked on reflections have been removed in their entirety even from the dials. Uh, and if we look up towards the sun we'll see that there are no Brillo pad scratches. Yay! Excellent! So that gets rid of that. It also works in the clip wing variant as you would expect and I'll show you that now. And here's the clip wing version. Same situation applies. No baked on textures, full stop. No scratches. So it works for both. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to come out and I'm going to show you how to install this from start to finish. So bear with me and I'll take you to that screen now. Okay so first of all you were going to your saved games folder for DCS, DCS Open Beta, this is mine uh, and you probably will have a liveries folder if you don't you'll need to create one. Go into the liveries folder and when you download the mod you will get this Cockpit Spitfire LF Mark 9. Go into there, that file will exist with a description lure and the images that I've changed. Putting the file in here is all you have to do, it's as simple as that. And this will automatically change the current scratches and baked on reflections to the version that I'm providing you with. So it's that simple. Now when you go into game you'll know that it's been activated and I'll show you what it will come up with on the screen. So here we are on the main splash screen. Now let's go up to the magic cog. Click on there. Go to special options. Scroll down to the Spitfire. And what you will see is customized cockpit and it will say improved scratches in there if the mod is activated. If you've done everything properly that's what it will say. That simple. So let's go back into the sim and I want to show you something else that is not impacted. And back in sim. This time I turned the rain on just to show you that the modification has no impact on the rain droplets at all. Open the canopy close the canopy. Again the reflections are not there so nothing's changed. Also it passes the integrity check because it's all part and parcel of the game. So I hope you'll find this useful and if you want to download it I'll create a link on the forums very shortly. I hope you found this video useful and thanks for watching. Ciao for now.